Hello everyone and welcome to Super T Console Gaming. It is more Mario Kart 8 Deluxe and we are continuing with our hand-drawn style series um, where we play in the 150cc um, Grand Prix and we do so in this wonderful looking hand-drawn filter. Um, I hope you like the way the game looks um, with the filter applied uh, because I think it looks absolutely fantastic. Um, and as I've already said, so much so that we ended up replaying the whole game through it. So here we are, off to the Egg Cup. Whilst we're first race is loading up, thank you very much for joining us and welcome. It's always great to have you along. Um, I hope you're all well. Let us know how you're going. Get in the comments and say hi. Do all that good stuff. We'll reply because we like talking to everybody that watches our videos. So here we go, Yoshi Circuit 150 in this awesome looking hand-drawn style, comic book, whatever you want to call it. But here we go. Wish me luck. Now, is it going to be a continuation of the Peach and Bowser show? Or is Shy Guy going to put his nose in it as well? Because he has been intermittently showing up as a series contender, which is odd because I've never really had to deal with him before. I think the only time I ever really got involved with Shy Guy in this game was when I wanted to make a video using Diana King's Shy Guy, and I needed Shy Guy in the video for it all to make sense. Yeah, there you go. That's how my brain works. Bet you're glad you got that insight. <laughs> oh, well. Let's do it. Toadette is the one to beat. Don't you take my coins. All right, round we go. That's lap number one done. We did okay, but not super great. Let's see how we travel through here. Have we got Toadette finally? Not quite, sort of, kinda, and I can't see. I ran into a door. Just, oh, I've run into another door. Doors everywhere. Jeez, I've taken that corner wrong, haven't I? Let's hit Bowser with that shell and try and, oh, through the tulips. It might be a song, but it's not particularly helpful to us at this moment. We need to stay out of the garden and on the racetrack. There we get. Okay, more coins for us. Oh, I finally got that half right. See you, Toadette. Nice doing business with you. More coins. Is that the game's pl Oh, blue shells. Why you gotta do me like that? Toadette was smart enough just to hang back. She was like, you can celebrate the blue shell. Oh, Peach on the bike. Oh, and someone hit me with a boomerang. Take your pick. I've gone from first to sixth in a matter of seconds. All right, now can we dig ourselves out of this hole? Get away from me, Red Shell. And we have dug ourselves out of the hole. It wasn't looking uh, promising there for a bit, but we managed to get away with it. That sort of last quarter of the third lap, we went from first to sixth and back to first. As try they might, we survived. Here it is, the screen of awkwardness. Those silhouettes just make me feel the need to talk awkwardly. Excite Bike Arena, I love this track. It either goes swimmingly or painfully. Um, and I usually don't have much control over that. So I, I look forward to whatever comes about. So here we go, starting off in pole position where we should have been all along. If I can get my sort of jumps right, which we have done so far. All right. Fantastic music on this track, of course. Stay away, the mud pile. Straight up the woozy. All right. Well, I'll tell you what. Feels like it's going all too well at the moment. Someone's got to get involved and hurt us here. 
I don't know who it's going to be. I suspect Peach with a with a blue shell or something untoward. He's like, your name might be on the box, son, but I'm the princess. Hey. Ah, oh, come off it. I, would, oh, ho, ho, ho. I don't know what stopped that red shell, but I'm kind of glad it was stopped. Look at that, going so fast over the hill, the red shell couldn't keep up. We've got two bananas to our name now. As we close out lap number two and line up for the finale, I would expect a visit from a blue shell any moment now. All we can do is ride off into the sunset and hope that it's not going to get here in time. Oh, Mario's just nailing this. Look at him go. Throw all the squid ink at us you want, mate. We're not interested. Oh. That's, that's a, wow, I'm just getting assaulted with green shells. Thankfully, none of them have hit me yet, but wow, they're just everywhere. Come on, get Big Muzz. There we go. All right, banana. Well done. Sorry, that's an example of a good time at Excite Bike Arena. Um, there are plenty of examples of bad ones. Who was up there? Lakitu. Toadette. All right. Off to race number three. We have thus far pulled in two firsts. Will our winning ways come to an end? Or will we continue? Oh, Dragon Driftway. I am predominantly a fan of the circuit tracks, so the boring ones, yeah, like Toad Circuit, Mario Circuit, that sort of stuff. Um, and whilst this is one of the more creative tracks and not usually my box of tricks, I love this track. I think it looks absolutely phenomenal and even better in this hand-drawn style that I've sort of been doing this series in. I know it's a little bit dark, um, but I just think it looks awesome. Anyway, enough talking. Bowser's got in front of me while I've been on the jibber-jabber. Try and string a few decent corners together here. Bowser knows that if he gets near us, he's going to cop a banana in the tailpipe. He's too busy concentrating on the red shell to realise that there was a corner coming up that I wasn't necessarily aligned for. Anyway, lap number one is done and lap two is underway. We've still got our... Oh, that's a bad corner. Bowser's is going to get past me here in a sec because I could Oh, blue shells. Blue shells this early. Come on. I don't think we actually... We didn't get any blue shells in the Excite Bike Arena, did we? We well and truly got away with that. No. We've stolen my jam. Come on. Now it's all a bit wonky. That's it, Mario. Just fling it around, son. Something's coming for me. I don't quite know what it is. I can hear it, or is it stopped? No, it's stopped. We're okay. As you were, Mario. <laughs> uh. All right, locking in for lap number three. Let's steal someone's mushroom. I do find that every time I hit a mushroom that's been left on the track, it's just in the wrong spot, and I should never have touched it. Just like that. I do try and avoid those um, sort of speed nut lugs or whatever they're called um, because I find that, that that little loop that he does um, to be quite confusing. Um, so I try and avoid it because I don't necessarily feel like it makes me any faster and increases the risk of me doing something silly. So if you're screaming at the television going, mate, there's a whole bunch of stuff there you could be hitting. Um, yeah, I know. I know. I just, I don't do it. 
doesn't work in my brain. Sometimes simple, logical things don't work in my brain. I've learned to accept it. Um, unfortunately, now you've got to see it. Um, screen of awkwardness again. Um, can we get through it without saying anything silly or awkward? Yeah, we did. Butte City. Good times. Hand-drawn, beautiful stuff. And I keep thinking, you know, as much as we all want an F-Zero game, they're too hard. <laughs> Look, I play F-Zero on the GameCube every now and then, and I'll tell you what, it's so hard. With that being said, let's get at it. Bowser, I'd appreciate it if you just stayed away. Oh, look at me go, just a boost pad specialist. Can't be stopped. And when I say can't be stopped, I mean will be stopped. Nothing silly's gonna happen up here. Like that, I run into a run into a guardrail because apparently that's how you go faster. Accelerates away from the red shell. It wasn't good enough to keep up with me. This one might be though. <laughs> you punk. Stay on the track. I be going doing nothing silly. Yeah. All right, let's get into the second lap somehow. After what was a half decent start. Oh. Get away from Bowser. I realized that when that shell was sent, he was in first, so he was going to cop it. And then I was driving right beside him. Because that's where you want to be when someone else is going to get hit with a blue shell right beside him. You can't say I'm not thinking about this. Oh, red shell. Oh, we just snuck that out, didn't we? It was dead set on my tail. Captain Falcon up there on the screen. Looking as dashing as always. Stay away from those damn bananas. Great start to the third lap where we nail all of these boost pads. Protect ourselves from the nasty red shell. Make another coin, Mario. All red shells. Can't get away from that one. Oh, he can, oh I was going to say, here comes another one, but he dropped off. Oh, blue shell again? Surely not. No. That's rubbish. That is rubbish. How deflating is that? Bowser, you don't deserve to be there, mate. Let's be honest. Anyway, with that being said, it's time to check out the highlights slash lowlights package. What are we going to get? More good stuff, more bad stuff? We are about to find out. Good start there from Mario. <laughs> These fly... Oh, there he is. How they deem that a highlight of dead set two wheels up on the guardrail and they're like, no, nah, no, nah, good stuff, chuck it in the package. <laughs> yeah, me getting hit by a blue shell. Yeah, me getting hit by something else. <laughs> Toadette's looking good. Well, oh yes, I landed that on Bowser's face. That's where it should be too. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for hanging out and watching us play the Egg Cup in this awesome hand-drawn style. We appreciate you doing that. If you've got questions, comments, or tips, jump in the comments and let us know. We get back to absolutely everybody. If you like the video, chuck us a like. If you would be so kind as to subscribe to the channel for more of this sort of stuff, that would also be awesome. Uh, but most importantly, thank you very much for watching. We appreciate it a whole bunch. So thank you. We'll see you all next time. Hooroo. Goodbye. See ya.